A man has been discovered alive three days after explosions ripped through a warehouse storing hazardous chemicals in China. At least 112 people have died and 85 firefighters are still missing. As the ABC's Hui Fen Tay reports, their families are demanding answers. A team of chemical specialists venture into the epicenter of the blast site in Tianjin looking for survivors. Just 50 metres away, 56-year-old Han Feng Chun is found in a shipping container, buckled from the sheer force of the explosion. He'd been lying there for three days, barely alive. Distraught families tried to gatecrash a government press conference demanding answers. Many people are still missing. Most of them are firefighters. It's been three days and nights. I don't have any information about my son. The relevant department hasn't given us any information at all. Authorities have now confirmed sodium cyanide was among the chemicals stored on site. They have extended the exclusion zone to three kilometres because of fears of contamination. It's still not clear what caused the original explosion. China is in shock over this tragedy. It highlights many safety concerns, lessons that Chinese President Xi Jinping says have been paid for with blood. Hui Fen Tei, ABC News, Beijing.